Great other news we're following this evening that fin spotted in the water off Middle Beach in Biddeford belongs to a great white shark. That's the word coming today from town officials. As New Center Maine's Jack Mulmud found out, we could expect to see more shark sightings as the summer warms the ocean. A possible shark sighting here on the beach off of Biddeford caused a temporary closure of the beach earlier this week. But people who research sharks told me that this happens just about every single summer and there's really nothing to be afraid of as long as you respect the ocean. So you know they're there and they it, this is their world. Michelle Dubé has lived in Maine all of her life and knows how to respect nature. We're coming into their world when we go into the ocean. Which is why she's not worried about a shark attacking her or her family. We had no fear of letting our kids go back in today. But just because there's no fear doesn't mean there's nothing down there. A great white shark just 150 feet from shore caused a closure Thursday. So I could see it with my naked eye and then with the binoculars just to double check. Ella Leonard was the lifeguard that spotted the great white. We do have to remember that it's just a sighting. It's on an attack. So any nerves that we have, we just kind of have to wash away. All is well after a quick look and then today back to normal. And I definitely think we're probably going to see another one, if not a few more. Trying to learn more about white sharks when they're coming up here to Maine. And as the summer water continues to warm up, shark buoys like this one deployed in June by the University of New England will help monitor whatever comes our way. Do you guys care that there's a shark there? No. And for Matt and Dylan. What's your message for people watching who may be scared of sharks? Don't be scared of sharks. They only have one thing on their mind. <laughs> Anything else interesting that you guys want to add? No. No. And it's not sharks, but going out there and catching a sick wave. In Biddeford, Jack Mulmud, News Center, Maine.